Representative Jayapal says President Biden has risen to the moment. <laughs> yeah, for his donors. How do you how do people take this kind of lying? So I would say to Kyle Kalinske, does it when she lies like this? Isn't that burning a bridge with us? Isn't that when they don't do a goddamn thing that they said they would? Isn't that burning a bridge with us? What is your mechanism to hold them accountable? When she's obviously just pissing in your face right now, because that's what this is. And you're just like, oh, it's good. She's my friend. I like you. Come on my show. I like you. We're good people. We we won't be mean to you. I certainly won't raise my voice like Jimmy Dore. She says President Biden has risen to the moment. Like a true justice democrat. Isn't she? Like a true justice democrat. <laughs> but I really do give him an A in what he's done so far. It's been bold. It's been progressive. It's been what the country needs. Tell that to the millions of people about to get kicked out of their house tomorrow. Tell that to the millions of people li living under fucking bridges. Tell that to the 100,000 people who died from COVID because they didn't have Medicare for all. Because 100,000 people would have been saved if there was Medicare for all. So this is a liar. This is someone who's a liar, who's a gaslighter, and who's, who is not fighting for you. And this is someone who we should make afraid. This is someone who every YouTube host should say, stop voting for her and stop giving her money and then see how she handles it. That's how you hold people accountable. You don't hold them accountable by being nice to them. And if you think that, you're the chump of all chumps and cucks of all cucks, and now I get it. I get it why you weren't at those marches last Saturday giving a speech. I get it. Because you're a nutless coward and you're protecting people like this. And until you tell your viewers to stop voting for them and to stop donating to them, you're part of the problem. You're now you are now bolstering the establishment. There's no doubt about it. And if you say we have to be nice to them, you're bolstering the establishment and you're hurting the movement. What the movement needs now is to put the fear of God in these motherfuckers. And when YouTube hosts uh, coddle them and protect them, uh, that's deleterious to the movement that you're supposed to give a shit about. Have some fucking balls. Stop pretending you don't know how politics works. And fight for something. Actually fight for something. Ruffle some feathers, you fucking nutless wonder. Fight for something. But you won't. That's why I'm doing it. That's why those people were doing it on Monday at AOC's office. That's why those people were out there last Saturday. And that's why you weren't. Because you're nutless and you'll never fight for shit. 